Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you how to install WKHTML to PDF on Apple Silicon. WKHTML to PDF is required by Udo to generate PDF files. I'll be following my own article on opensourcehustle.com and I'll have the link to that article in the description. Now WKHTML does not have an official binary for Apple Silicon, but we can still run Intel based applications using Rosetta 2. Rosetta 2 acts as an emulator translating Intel instructions into ARM instructions, which allows us to run Intel based applications on our ARM architecture. To install Rosetta 2, open your terminal and run the following command. Now with Rosetta installed, we can actually install WKHTML to PDF using the Intel 64-bit installer. So let's go to the official WKHTML to PDF page and let's download the Intel installer by clicking 64-bit. Now right click on the installer, click open, open and proceed with the installation. I'm going to keep everything default and we have installed WKHTML to PDF. Now let's test WKHTML to PDF by trying to generate PDF files in our Udo application. I'll be starting our Udo application which we have created in the previous tutorial. Firstly, I'll activate our virtual environment. Then I'll start the Udo application by running Python 3 Udo bin and include my database name, which was Alex and Bloom, basically my username. And in the logs, we could already see that Udo can find WKHTML to PDF in this directory. Let's open our application by going to the local host. The username and password are admin. And let's go to the invoicing module, open one of the invoices. Let's click print and send. And let's try to download the invoice. And we can see that it was able to generate a PDF file using WKHTML to PDF. Now I'd like to mention an additional point and that is with Rosetta installed, you can open your terminal using Rosetta as well and install Intel based applications using your terminal. You can do that by opening your applications folder, going to utilities, right click on your terminal, get info, and then you'll have the option here to open using Rosetta. If I check this option, close this, quit the terminal and reopen it again. If we check the architecture, we no longer get the ARM architecture. As I've mentioned in my article, if you get 8664 or i386, then you are using the Rosetta emulator correctly. Now you should be able to generate PDF files using your Udo application or any other applications that require WKHTML to PDF. Thank you for watching.